and we are back. There is a shot of Unite Gaming getting ready to go. They will be facing off against Optic, the first match here live from Full Sail University. The MLG Fall Invitational is seconds away. And Revan, I think we need a little pre-game predictions from our fans. If you're cheering for Unite Gaming, stand up and make some noise. We got like eight people here in the front row. If you want Optic Gaming to take this one, make some noise. Revan, the game is eight seconds away. Let's get into the action as we head to Slums for some hard point. Well, Slums hard point, it's all about your anchor player here, Pucket. If your anchor player is able to stay alive in the back of the map, get your team the more favorable spawns, then you're spawning closer to the hard point and you're able to put on a ton more pressure. And let's kick things off with the new guy on Optic Gaming. It's JCAP. All right, so here we go, getting right into the action, and we got JCap on your screen, Rev. And talk to me a little bit about this guy on this first deal. What's JCap's goal? Well, he's the anchor player for Optic Gaming, so his initial goal is to help them out with winning the middle position, and then he wants to lead his team on rotation, trying to take control of the back tables to get good position on the next hard point. So JCap getting taken down the first attempt, and down goes JCap again. Killa already on a four kill spree. He's got his streaks in the first 45 seconds. He's working on that war machine as well. Of course, we should remind people the sentry gun has been removed for this tournament. Shotgun still allowed. Oh, but Killa. Oh my, Killa. You said he's one of the best in the game of hardpoint. And let's take a look at his stats 7 0, a cap and five defense, 1,100 points already. That's Hard as many as I've put up an entire game. Yeah, Optic, they don't even have a single point on the board yet, and Kill It, normally he's that submachine gun guy for Unite Gaming, but just on the map slumps, he's not afraid to pull out the AN-94, and he's putting oh. it to use here. Big T goes down, Killa is on your screen, and look at the spawn, talk to me That's about this positioning. Though. Not the best when you got 40 seconds left on the clock. This is a big play out of Optic. Yeah, and he's using to use the Hellstorm missile there, which, you know, he could have saved it for a bit later on in the game, but they're off to a very strong start here, and they're going to fight for the rest of the time on the hard point. Nice shot there onto Nature, and now they're going to put Optic in a bit of a spawn trap. Oh, my contested. goodness. Optic in trouble early on as you're going to see Kill pick up the 60th second. We're only going to 250, and to see a team with this many points already, that is going to be devastating. Also, I want to point out the mini map here guys look how far away optic is they're not going to contest this hard point they're going to be setting up for the next one and kill it he's got the lightning strike which can do all kinds of damage point and unite their point is perfectly talk to me about this rotation the you see them they're all going to stack the garage side of the map once they're on the position to push out the anchor player kill it pings his lightning strike going to call that and here comes the unite players they're looking to gain control of the spawns all right kill is only going to get one on big timer scumpy doing big work let's jump on board with the ginger ninja after that three piece Four kills in a row for Scumpy, locking down the hard point. He's working on a Hellstorm and Lightning Strike of his own. So far, it's looking good for Unite, oh but they have control of the spawns. But here comes Scumpy, does get shut down by Ricky, and it looks like more kills are going in favor of Unite Gaming. They have control of the spawns, so they're going to fight for the rest of the time on the hard point. On board now with the captain of uh, the Optic Gaming Squad. We got Big Timer on your screen. Ours. He's been winning championships since he was 16 years old. Talk to me about this guy. Well, Big Timer, we said it before in the pregame show. Normally, he's the assault rifle player for Optic Gaming to kind of support JCAP. But this event, he's used to use his submachine guns. So he's got a bit of a different role to play here. And he's struggling already. 5 and 11 for Big T. Nate shot oh, held at 3 and 10. Meanwhile, Killa. 15 and 5 already. Scumpy having a strong game at 12 and 9, and JCap also at double digits. But Optic, they're going to need to get something going. And I want to see what's going wrong for Nade Shot at the moment. Well, in terms of the Optic team in general, so you saw them on, it all started at that bottom lot hard point after Killer used that Hellstrom missile. They still had some sort of control on the spawns, but once they got taken out, they tried to set up for the white wall hard point. Then the streak did go in favor of Unite as they're able to break the anchor position. They got control of spawns, and Optic has been behind ever since. Nade shot getting hit with concussions, can't get across the map. There's just all kinds of grenades being thrown his way. Look at this as it's Killa pulling out the Hard war machine contested. and doing huge damage. Nameless with a double kill on Big T and Scumpy and Killa right back into the hard point. This has all been Unite Gaming in the first four minutes. They are dominating. Not only that, Killa just got a great spawn for the next hard point, moving over to the middle statue. Unfortunately, it doesn't have any more score streaks, no more lightning strike, no more hellstorm missile. Only a couple shots left in that war machine, and he could put it to use here. 
All right, so it looks like they got three in middle. J-Cap, I haven't lit up on your mini-map in the bottom right-hand corner, trying to anchor for the next hard point, but he's going to be picked off by a nice rotation from Parasite, staying on board with kill. Point, he's got down. the most kills in the game, but now everyone from this Unite squad in that kill feed. You just saw Nameless kill in it again with his second kill on Big T. J-Cap trying to answer back for Optic, and here comes Nadeshot and Scuffy. Scuffy with that Scorpion going big to secure the hill, but there's 26 seconds left, and Optic, they want to start thinking about this rotation. Scumpy's leading the charge, finally going down at the hands of Nameless. I'm actually quite surprised that Scumpy's using the Scorpion on slums, at least. The MSMC, it's a lot better fit for this map. You're going to be fighting more mid to long range engagements, and we all know the Scorpion, that's great for close range engagements, which you don't really find too often on slums. And here's that Scorpion kill from Scumpy as he takes down Parasite, nice. who is in the anchor. Down goes another player as Ricky gets just ripped by that Scorpion. But Killa cannot be stopped so far. A three kill spree. Full red, he's gonna challenge, gets the health back, a great patience there, and the hill is gonna be cleared out by his teammates, oh, and man. a headshot at range on Big T. Yeah, Killer switching over to his sub here, but it's only Ricky left alive inside the Ooh. hill. He gets taken out, so off the game, and they're gonna try to fight for the 40 seconds remaining, but here comes Unite, Parasite inside the hardpoint, finding Nature, turn around, sees Jacob in the contested. back as well. It's currently contested, Parasite trying to hold on. You know, I said I thought Scumpy was going to have most kills in the game. Let's see where he's at. 20 and 19, but it's still kill on top at 25. Also, Jcap, 20 and 13 in this game, doing a fantastic job of staying alive, trying to anchor. The question is, can they hold on to the junk hard point this time around? They failed to do so last time as they were cleaned up by the lightning strike and the three-man push through Garage by Unite. You know, the kill-death ratios are, are nice and pretty and all, but it's all about the defense come. Optic Gaming as a team, they only have four defense. Killa has six by himself, and in total, Unite have well over 10. So they're doing work inside the hardpoint, and that's reflected in the overall score. Scumpy with a nice two. Gonna light up Parasite, gets the assist there as Big T is gonna secure the hardpoint. 174 to 90, three minutes, 30 seconds left on the clock. Optic is not out by any means, and Scumpy, he is doing the dirty work, getting this bricks cut off. Look how far away the Unite team is spawning. If they can get this hill and the next one, they'll be right back in it. In fact, they can take the lead on this on this garage hardpoint. And point. these are the last two hardpoints where we see teams make these late game comebacks. If Optic are able to hold on to the time and earn themselves some score streaks, they're gonna put themselves in a great position as Scump goes it's currently on a five kill spree. And that was a big play too from Scumpy because that player was going to call down a score streak. It looked like Scumpy with another kill on Killa. Look at your scoreboard, 174 to 125. They make it a 50 point game. Optic on the comeback, Scumpy on the six kill spree leading the way. Scump needs to get these Capture points on the hard point. If he jumps in there, he would have earned himself the lightning strike, but he's using to stay alive over near Graveyard. Gets taken That's out just short of the lightning way. strike, but that Hellstorm missile, it's going to be so useful in the next hard point. Oh, yeah, that center hard point. The Hellstorm can do so much damage. Scumpy needing to go big here. Two players to the front, and he gets up both. Parasite drop. Rickney is dropped, and Scump looking for players trying to challenge the anchor, but no. Unite, they're spawning across the map. Pushing from blue. Optic is in a fantastic position here. Yeah, you see on the main map, Unite Gaming, they're still trying to flip the spawns, which I don't agree with. Clearly, Optic, they've held others hard point. They're gonna take the lead in this game. Unite Gaming need to cut their losses, rotate to the middle oh hard point, and make their stand there. I cannot believe what Optic has done on these back hard points. Look at your scoreboard, Revan. 15 seconds away. Finally, kill up from Unite breaking in. He was the star in the first four minutes, and then Unite slowed down. There's another big kill. That one from Nade Shot. Everyone stepping up here for this Optic Gaming Squad. 31 and 22 from Scumpy ties kill it for first place. And he's just a monster, but keep in mind, Scump also has that Hellstorm missile. I'm looking for him to use it here to try to clear Unite off the hard point so they can push it and take control. And here it comes. Just like you called, Revan. He's going to not cluster. He's just going to let it fall. No kill. Nameshot's going to pick it up before it can land. But he did get the positions. Picks one. Looking for Ricky inside the hard point. Can he get him? Ricky doing a fantastic job staying alive. Finally cleaned up. And your score it is with 15 now. 189 to 176 and counting, and Scump is getting cross-map kills with the Scorpion. Yeah, so close to even more score tricks. If he drops back, 
tries to fight for position at the next level. Oh, with that kill, he gets him anyway. Taking out Nameless Lab, but he's not done just yet. Trying to earn himself the war machine, and he gets it. Oh my, Stumpy! Fully streaked out the crowd here in Winter Park, Florida. Going insane as Optic has taken the lead with 50 seconds left on the clock. The final rotation, Unite. They don't have any streaks that I'm aware of, Rev. And we got Scumpy locking down bricks at range with the Scorpion. Can they hold on to a three second lead? Scump starting to spawn out, but he's gonna immediately call in the Lightning Strike. Unite game, they're trying to spread out, but the Lightning Strike saw some dead in their Triple. track. Scump, this is his show, man. He's going off right now. He took out Big T, but he got two in the meantime. 25 seconds left on the clock, and this one nearing mathematically impossible. Here comes Kill into the hill, the triple, and Kill on a three kill spree. There with Ricky, the score streak from Scump doing the damage. 15 seconds left on the clock, and that is not it's enough. Over. It's gonna be Optic Gaming. And you heard Scumpy in his pregame interview saying that hype was a factor. Well, they're pretty hyped up in that booth bucket. Oh my goodness, do you see Scumpy right now? Scump just had the game of his life, Pucket, finishing on top of the scoreboard. These guys are so excited, and it was all United at the start of the game. At one point, they had around an 80-point lead, but off the game, able to make the comeback thanks to some massive slaying by Scumpy and near-perfect anchoring from JK. We gotta see these kills from 46. Scump. 46! 46 kills. kills as Scumpy leads the way. It's Optic Gaming and game number one, but it's a best of three. Unite will be looking for revenge. Capture the flag on the same map is coming up after this.